Have you ever wondered why your beloved feline friend presses their paws into you like they're kneading dough? This act, known as kneading, is a fascinating and somewhat mystifying behavior common to our furred companions. It's that rhythmic alternating motion they make, pushing in and out with their paws, often on a soft surface like your lap or a cozy blanket. It's as if they're a tiny baker, diligently working on a loaf of bread. But why do they do this? Is it merely a quirk of their nature or is there a deeper meaning behind this peculiar ritual? Well, it's not just a random behavior, far from it. The answer to this mystery lies deep within their feline instincts and behaviors. Curious? Stick around as we unravel this intriguing puzzle exploring the origins, science and the comforting truth behind why cats need. It's a journey that promises to deepen your understanding and appreciation for these remarkable creatures. The story of needing starts at the very beginning of a cat's life. Picture newborn kittens, blind and helpless, yet instinctively aware of one crucial behavior, needing. This small action, a rhythmic pressing of paws against their mother's belly, is their first step towards survival. You see this kneading motion stimulates the flow of milk from their mother, ensuring these tiny creatures get the nourishment they need to grow and thrive. And as these kittens grow, this behavior continues, evolving from a survival tactic into a comforting routine. Even as they wean off their mother's milk and transition to solid food, the kneading doesn't stop. It remains ingrained in their behavior, a remnant of their early days of life. It's a piece of kittenhood that stays with them, a comforting habit that they carry into their adult years. As the kittens mature into cats, the kneading continues, taking on new layers of meaning. It's no longer just about survival or comfort, it becomes a way for cats to express contentment, to show affection, and to mark their territory. But we'll delve into those aspects later. For now, let's focus on the roots of this behavior. So what starts as a simple survival instinct in those early days of life becomes a deeply ingrained behavior, a part of their identity as cats. It's fascinating, isn't it? This small, seemingly trivial action has such deep roots tied to the very essence of being a feline. And there you have it. The early kneading behavior of kittens, while practical, sets the stage for a lifetime of kneading. This seemingly simple action, this rhythmic pressing of paws is far more than just a quirky feline behavior. It's a testament to their survival instincts, a comforting routine carried from kittenhood, and a fascinating glimpse into the complex world of these captivating creatures. So the next time you see a cat kneading, remember, you're witnessing a behavior that's been with them from the very start of their lives. But kneading isn't just about kittenhood. There's a whole science behind it. The rhythmic pushing and pulling of the paws, often compared to a baker kneading dough, is indeed a fascinating phenomenon with a host of scientific explanations. Firstly, let's talk about endorphins. These are chemicals produced by the body to relieve stress and pain. They interact with the opiate receptors in the brain to reduce the perception of discomfort, similar to drugs such as morphine and codeine, but without the negative side effects, of course. When cats need, it's believed that these endorphins are released, creating a sense of euphoria and well-being. So yes, your feline friend isn't just mindlessly pushing their paws into your lap, they're actually on a natural high. But there's more to kneading than just feeling good. It's also a way for cats to bond with their human companions. You see, cats are tactile creatures. They use touch as a form of communication. When a cat needs you, it's their way of telling you that they trust you, that they feel safe with you. It's a form of feline affection that's as heartwarming as it is mysterious. Moreover, kneading serves as a form of exercise for cats, helping them to stretch their paws and keep their muscles toned. It's a bit like yoga for cats, if you will. A little bit of kneading here, a little bit of stretching there, and voila, a happy, healthy cat. So the next time your cat begins to knead, remember this. It's not just a quirky behavior. It's a complex combination of instinct, chemistry, and communication. It's a sign of trust and affection, a cat's way of expressing contentment and comfort. So, when your cat needs you, they're not just making biscuits, they're expressing their love and comfort. And in their own unique way, they're letting you know that they're happy to be with you. Now, isn't that something to cherish? There's more to needing than meets the eye. It's also about marking territory. You see, cats are territorial creatures by nature, and they possess a unique way of laying claim to what they consider theirs. And this includes you. Cats have scent glands located in various parts of their bodies, including their paws. These glands secrete pheromones, which are chemical substances that serve as a form of communication among animals of the same species. Just as humans leave fingerprints, cats leave their unique scent mark wherever they tread. 
When your feline friend needs, they are not only indulging in a comforting habit but also subtly marking their territory. By pressing their paws into surfaces, they release these pheromones, effectively claiming that space or person as their own. It's their way of saying, this is mine. And it's a behavior that's deeply rooted in their ancestry. Long before cats were domesticated, their wild ancestors used scent marking as a way to establish boundaries. It was their method of saying, this is my turf, respect it. Over time, domestic cats have retained this instinctual behavior, although their territories have now shifted from vast wilderness to your cozy living room. While kneading on you might be a little uncomfortable, especially if your cat has sharp claws, take it as a compliment. It's your cat's way of showing trust and affection. They're essentially saying, I feel safe and comfortable with you. You're my human. This behavior can also provide insights into your cat's mood and well-being. If your cat needs frequently, it's a good sign that they're relaxed and content. Conversely, if your cat suddenly stops needing or does it excessively, it could indicate stress or discomfort and a visit to the vet might be in order. So, the next time your cat needs your lap, remember, they're staking their claim. They're not just seeking comfort, they're saying, I love you, you're mine. And isn't that just the most endearing territorial claim you've ever heard? Cats needing can also be quite entertaining. There's a certain humor that comes with our feline friends needing escapades. It's like they're the star bakers in a whimsical bakery, and everything from your tummy to your favorite throw pillow is their dough of the day. You see, cats don't discriminate when it comes to kneading. They'll knead on anything soft, fluffy, or even not so soft. Picture this. A cat kneading on a pile of laundry fresh out of the dryer. Or how about a cat kneading on a shaggy rug, its paws disappearing into the deep pile? There's even a tale of a cat who found great joy in kneading a fluffy dog, much to the dog's bemusement. And then there are those cats who knead the air, paws rhythmically pushing and pulling at nothing at all, as if they're conducting an invisible orchestra or practicing some feline form of Tai Chi. It's as amusing as it is adorable. Yet the humor in these kneading anecdotes isn't just about the odd places or things they choose to knead, it's also about the unique individual personalities that shine through. Each cat has its own kneading style, its own rhythm, its very own personality. So kneading isn't just about instincts, it's also about their quirky personalities. It's these little quirks that make our feline friends so endearing, and their kneading escapades a source of both amusement and comfort. So why do cats knead? The truth is quite comforting. As we've journeyed through the captivating world of feline kneading, we've uncovered several fascinating reasons. It all starts when they're kittens, using this instinctual behavior to stimulate their mother's milk. As they grow into adulthood, this kneading action doesn't just disappear, instead it evolves, serving multiple purposes in their lives. In the realm of science we've discovered that kneading can be a source of relaxation for cats. The rhythmic pushing of paws might just be releasing endorphins, those feel-good chemicals we often associate with pleasure and contentment. This might explain why your cat seems so blissed out when they're kneading away on your lap. But kneading isn't solely about personal satisfaction. Cats are also communicating with us and their environment. Through the scent glands in their paws, they're marking their territory, declaring to the world, this is mine. Whether it's your lap, a favorite blanket or even another pet, cats use kneading to establish their presence and create a sense of security. All these reasons, from practical to emotional, circle back to one comforting truth. Kneading is a sign of a content and happy cat. It's a beautiful expression of their trust and affection a testament to the unique bond between cats and their human companions. So the next time your cat starts needing, sit back, relax, and enjoy these moments of pure feline contentment.